relationship is something that requires constant work. Doc, I just feel like sometimes he's not even trying anymore. Seriously, he's okay. clingy, he's terrified of being by himself. Given all these strong feelings, why don't you hold hands? Um, he's literally reaching out for you. He won't hold my hand. Oh, you you got to interlock it, though. If you don't interlock you it, you might as well just be friends I'm... and not partners. How you bitches like Jump Street now? Hey. I got a big ass raise to babysit you two fuckers again. You going back to high school? No, you dumb motherfucker. Your ass look like you about 50. You going to MC State. Play on, play. Why every time you speak, I want to throw the fuck up? Hot plate. Beanbag chair. Hilarious shirt that signals we drink alcohol. Are you two fucking around in school again? It's the same case. Do the same thing. It's not exactly the same case, because uh, one of us got laid last night. <laughs> We're talking missionary. We're talking missionary. Missionary. We're talking when I'm on top and she's on her back. Damn. Get the fuck back to work. We need an expert to consult. I heard someone's bringing a shit ton of that stuff down to parts of Mexico for spring break. That's your lead, motherfucker. I know, but we don't know who it is. Uh, we don't know who it is. That's you. That doesn't sound anything like me. It's not not you. Eric, close your eyes and tell me who's talking right now. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's Schmidt being a little bitch. Look, you gotta take your thing to the next level, guys. Spring break, motherfucker. A grenade. You never know. Oh, why are you gonna put it there? Feels right. Hey, my partner here, he wanna see that product. Where'd you find this gringo, man? The fucking Mumford and Sons concert and shit? <laughs> Remember me? I'm your best nightmare. I'm your worst nightmare. Go, go! Got the Lambo in the back. Oh, oh, no! Get me! No! What? No! What were you doing? What am I doing? Why did you try to kiss me? Well, I didn't fucking try and kiss you. No, you're leaning in again. I didn't want to kiss. This is the most uncomfortable fist fight I've ever been in. Oh, hey, listen, there's a grenade in my shorts. You got it? That's my dick. What about that? That's my dick also. What the? Bring it up! All the way! Dad, you can't keep spending money on junk. I can break it down, strip it for parts. This stuff is what's gonna put you through college. Something in here needs to make this family some money. Come on, you old wreck. Judgment day. What the hell happened to you? Look, this is not normal steel. I don't think it's a truck at all. I think we just found a transformer. Dad! I'm gonna ask you this once. Where is Optimus Prime? You know, we got a rule about messing with people from Texas. is over. Don't you get it? We don't need you anymore. family.
this chaos. A thousand people in an iron box. 18 years I've hated my train. 18 years I've waited for this moment. This is your world. The train saved humanity. The engine lasts forever. The population must always be kept in balance. I said sit down. Passengers, eternal order flows from the sacred engine. We must occupy our preordained position. I belong to the front. You belong to the tail. No your place. Keep your place. Those bastards in the front think they own us. We'll be different when we get there. What do you say? We take the engine. And we control the world. When is the time? Soon. This is disorder. We're going to the front. Open the gate. We know you well, Mr. Curtis. We've been watching you. Precisely 74% of you shall die. Everybody back! I'm not a leader. You're ready, huh? Mr. Mulligan, this is Distressed Records. Your 10 o'clock meeting started 15 minutes ago. So what are we doing here? It's not working. You gotta go. I'm taking my client list. It's not Jerry Maguire. I'm taking my art list. Oh, I got to get away from you. Get away. I'm coming back for that. Don't tell your mom I lost my job today. You got money to pay for these? I'm a kid. I don't have any money on you me. You have your pocket money. Well, I spent that on condoms. No, 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 no. A total rock star. <laughs> Unbelievable. We don't want anything to stand in his way. Capiche? I'm just tagging along. <laughs> Babe, we need to talk. So, this is a new song for anyone who's ever been alone in the city. So you find yourself at the subway. You realize it's the end of the line. I was having a nervous breakdown, and then I heard your song. I want to make records with you. Come on, let's get out of here. You're going to have to get these beers, though. Let's record an album. We don't even need to rent a studio. We can record outside. Every song we do in a different location. Under the bridge. Side of town. Rowing boats in Central Park. Whatever happens, we record it. If we get arrested. Keep rolling. Hey, you, come back here. Where are you going? Check it out, your boyfriend just won a music gong. If I could somehow do anything that would undo what I did to us, just tell me what it is. I think everything has changed. Nice beard, you loser. <laughs> a guy like that falls on his lip for a couple of years. People lose sight of who he is. This really is a bit of a long shot, isn't it? Absolutely. That's when the magic happens. Waiting for the next move, anticipating the next groove. And the road is long, and you're only as strong as your next move. Yo, Fat Jimmy, did you get that down? I got it. All right, because that was exceptionally good. It's easy sometimes to feel like you're powerless, like when you come out in the streets and you march and you yell and nobody hears you. But I'm here to tell you today, you are powerful. You can stop this bill. A co-founder of the social news and entertainment website Reddit has been found dead. Aaron learned how to learn 
at a very young age. Bob introduced him to computers, and he just took off. He certainly was a prodigy, although he never kind of thought of himself like that. He really had different aspirations for the purposes of political goals. He was sort of learning to hack politics. Stop SOPA! This bill poses a serious threat for all who use the internet. The freedoms our country had been built on would be suddenly deleted. I couldn't let that happen. Aaron was trying to make the world work. He was trying to fix it. Bringing public access to the public domain. He doesn't hack JSTOR in the traditional sense of hacking. He wasn't stealing, he was making a point. They arrested him, strip searched him, and left him in solitary confinement. And he said, they want to make an example out of me. On the internet, everybody has a license to speak. It's a question of who gets heard. Aaron Schwartz was not a criminal. You can say, oh, this is another instance of cyber war. The cyber criminals are attacking us again. They use those as excuses to push through more and more dangerous laws. This is a poor use of prosecutorial discretion. Should have never gotten the attention of the criminal system. We need to galvanize opposition today because today is when it matters. I'm still angry. This is what we as a people think is okay. Aaron was willing to put himself at risk for the causes that he believed in. He was the internet's own boy and the old world killed him.